Hey folks, so welcome back to the DZMC Gaming Channel. Uh, we're going to go back in. Looks like our friend has taken his turn. Um, I did upload the first episode, first three rounds of this game, and we are now into the fourth round, and it's Germany's turn. So again, my job here is Germany in a KGF. Well, looks like we might only get one turn out here, but I will pause it and see if he comes back. Uh, our job is to survive, hold really as long as we can. We're eight of nine victory cities. We have a potential for a VC snipe here. He did not build. I see. He did not build. So we definitely have a VC snipe here. Let's see. It's nine infantry and an industrial complex on Norway, no doubt. Yeah. Okay. No combat. He's still got these two guys here. Why? So, what can he bring? He can bring 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 to here. Hmm, it's going to be tough to hold both of these. But I think that's what we're going to do. Um, we're going to try anyway. Purchased one tank, three infantry, two artilleries. Uh, liberated on Y via tank blitz. Okay. And liberate the territory. Destroyed one tank and one artillery with no units lost in battle in Szechuan. Okay. Uh, you do so. We can destroy two infantry lost, but one infantry in Ukraine. You know, that pretty heavy. Okay. And in West Russia. West Russia. So. We can defend this against the British. Especially because he's got two of his transports here. So he's only got two transports he can even bring to bear on here and here. Total of eight guys here, though. I hmm. wonder if he'll see that coming. Wait, it's risky to do no combat, though, isn't it? And what can I bring to this battle? Just three infantry, I think. Oh, that's so scary. Um, one, two, three, four, yeah. That's safe. Oh, he can bring this plane to this battle as well. Mind you, these two were left off. So, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Should be enough against the British. This is a loaded two transports, yep, including a tank, so it's four, five, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen that can hit this with the Americans. Americans! Seven, eight, nine, ten. If I ignore this, eleven, twelve, thirteen, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 18. Just, I don't even need that many tanks there, because I know we can't go in there with the British. And because he stacked West Russia here, um, that's actually a good thing. Because then it won't look like I'm trying to not attack this on purpose. I do this. Different story. I gotta guard that. Obviously guard this. These planes are going to have... Well, how are we going to mix them up?
bit risky, isn't it, huh? I think it's a bit risky. 9, 10, 11. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 16. More than enough than the British can bring. So I don't anticipate him attacking that. What I anticipate him doing is actually, st if I leave this, is to continue to stack it. Can how many planes can help? Just two bombers, right? One, two, three, four. Yeah, shoot. Oh, plus. Oh, wait a minute. He does have. He could come in here. Not if I go this way. Plus, after the shellacking he took <laughs> earlier, I'd be a little nervous about this territory. Um, but if I go this way, I've got—I've only got to fool the British. If I can fool the British and I'm not attacking any of these territories, then I'm pretty sure the Americans cannot. They need a one-two punch to do it. So can I do it? I think I can. I think I can, I think I can. Well, but if this doesn't work, but this could really set me back. Wish I left a cruiser there. Damn it, I didn't really need him to take this. What are the odds on three infantry? I, I've, I've done this math before, but I just I need to do it in my right now. Three infantry against one infantry. Who wins that? Ninety percent of the time, that's a ninety percent win. But we all know it can be a a loss. We all know that. Um. I'm going to try it. I think I'm going to try it because I think I can... goes. I can put these three fighters, or these two bombers there. And that could either force him north or keep him here. This play, I don't understand all this. I mean, he's staging, obviously. All right, so let me pause, and I'm going to do some math on all of this just to protect against an American attack. I'm not going to, well, and a 1-2 with a British attack here. So let me do that, and I'll get back to you guys, and uh, so stay with me. I'm just going to pause it here. All right, so I've done the math, and I can do it. Got to have six guys here, well, five guys, including an A gun here. And that's his best shot. He can bring infantry tank, uh, th three fighters, one, two, three, well, actually, one, two, three, yeah, he can bring all three fighters and two guys, that's five guys, so five guys and an AA gun should do that.
here he can only bring four. Six. And then he can follow up with these guys cannot reach. So basically he can follow up with well, some combination of six units. Seven. Eight nine. To here. I'm gonna build ten. He can bring these two. I actually think I can take these two out. So that's what we're going to do. So we're going to build. Oh, hold on. It's got to pause for a second here, guys. Hang on. Stay with me. <laughs> yeah. All right. We're back. Oh, I'm figuring this out in my head. Uh, let's see what we can build here. I think that's it, really. Okay. Oh, I don't like giving this up. <laughs> I really don't like giving this up. Um. Not worried about the British attacking. The only thing I'm worried about the British actually attacking is France and Italy. Um, not even really worried about them attacking Berlin. Well, let's see if we can kill these two guys here. That's important. One, two, three, four. Okay. It's the only attack we're going to make, folks. Actually, if I kill this. Well, he'll take the infantry, but then he won't be able to take a tank. Well, he can take one tank. I mean, maybe I'm going to try that. Oh, I can land planes there. One, two, three, four. Oh, that even helps. That helps. That's actually going to make it easier now. I don't really have to kill this, but I'm going to try it anyway. All right. Of course, the big deal is, can three infantry take out one infantry? In my luck, it won't be able to. But it should. That's the worst. Gotta do it again. Whoa. Okay. So now that even makes Germany even safer now, because you can only move four, five, six. To that. That's good to be safe. Well let's get the let's get the hit on the tank here. That's all we needed. Okay, it's worth it. Okay, so we're going to move these guys this way. Uh, now we got to split these guys up. Uh, here, here, here. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 18 guys. I'm going to keep all of them there with the two bombers. So it's going to be 20 guys. Now I guess I kind of still, uh, yeah, because the British go before me, so I kind of still need to guard this. So we can, I think we can guard it with a plane. 
build two infantry there. How many did I build? Thirteen. Two of them are going here. So we need... Two here. All four here. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Not reach, so you can bring this guy can reach one, two, three, four. So three, four, five. You can bring eleven. The British can bring one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, wait. Um, yeah, I need to protect it for now, so it's the right move. I need one of these tanks go down here. And one of the A guns, too. What does that look like actually? It's tank, infantry. So it's five infantry. Or, yeah, five infantry. One, two, three, four. So it's four infantry. Tank. Two, art two artilleries and two tanks. Four infantry, two artilleries and two tanks. Let me keep you on for this one. Four infantry, two tanks, two artillery, and how many planes did I say? One. Just one plane to Berlin. And a cruiser. and a cruiser hit and I'll have 12 so it's 12 13 so 12 1 1 12, 1 and 1, and an AA. Hmm. Doesn't seem like it's enough, does it? 12, 1, 1, and an AA. What does that look like? It's got a 2.4% chance on that. 
the defender only loses 18, let's say, let's say, let's be generous, let's say 20 IPC. Let's say 7 infantry. So say I lose 7 infantry. 12 gives me 5, 1, and 1, and an AA gun. Hmm. Against 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Three infantry, two artillery, and a tank. That's what that looks like. Three infantry, two artillery, and a tank, and three fighters, was it? Cruiser and a battleship. Three planes, yeah. Cruiser and a battleship. Against what I have left. He wins 95.8. Hmm. I've got to have some of these planes have to be there. Let's rethink that. What does that look like now? 12 infantry, one artillery. Well, it actually could be technically two artillery. So, so it's 11, 2, 2, 1, and 2. 11, 2, 2, 1, and 2. What does that look like? Well, actually, mm, got to redo the calculation with the uh, British hitting first. So they can attack with 4, 2, and 2. One fighter and a cruiser. Again, so what I say it was 11, 2, 2, AA, and two fighters, of which those two fighters are going to go last. What's that look like? So then I lose even less IPC. So five IPC. So that goes down to six. Then he can bring, is it three infantry, one tank, two artillery? And three planes, and then the bomber cruiser. So three infantry, two tanks, one artillery, three fighters, cruiser, and a oh, not a bomber. Cruiser and a battleship. To my six two two, that should be better. That's gonna win. Then we'll have seven eight. So it'll be. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 11 infantry, 2 artillery, that's 13, and 3 tanks is 16. That's safe, I think. Unless he came in with everything to here. Which case, he'd have to hit with the British first. So that's, <laughs> I'm redoing the math all over again in my head. I don't know if I have enough to cover all these victory cities. Well, if he goes in there, he'll have to be severely out of, and he loses fleet. So that's a, Italy is a big risk for him. What if I save the plane, put the plane back here? And he can only attack with two transports full of guys and a tank and a fighter and a cruiser. I doubt the British hit that first. That's a mauling. Well, it's actually... No, he can actually bring uh, three infantry and a tank 
Another two tanks and an artillery. Hmm. But we will be able to get... Americans can't really attack it. Well, I mean, we can get the planes there, but... We'll have two bombers in support. I don't know if this is going to work. extra plane to bear. Well, okay, well, let's do the math on this. So it's 7, 8, 9. 10, 11 infantry. Two artillery, three tanks, and a fighter. That's what that looks like. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So it's 11, three tanks, one artillery, no AA gun. One fighter, right? 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So 11, 2 artillery, 3 tanks. And 1 fighter. Against his 1. Three infantry, two tanks, and an artillery. Three infantry, two tanks, artillery, and one. We could bring this too. Well, it's actually three tanks. Uh, three tanks. How many planes? One. Can't reach. Just the one plane and a cruiser. Okay, let's see what that looks like. Should be eleven. This should be eleven infantry, three tanks, two artillery. That's what that looks like. Okay, so I only lose. Okay, well, it says thirteen point three. So let's say five units. So if I lose five, there that goes down to six. Six, three, two, and one. Now the Americans can buy. No, this is a lot of math. Two. Five. Two infantry, five infantry. Three, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Five infantry, two artillery, and one tank. Five infantry. Oh, no, it's actually five infantry. No, it's actually one, two, three. Ah, hold on a second. One, two, three, plus three is six infantry. Two tanks. Seven infantry, two tanks, two artillery. That's a lot. Seven infantry, two tanks, two artillery, but he can bring three fighters. And a cruiser and a battleship. 
cruiser and battleship. I'll have six, three, two, and one. Mm. Attacker wins 80%. Mm. So Karelia is the thorn in my side here. Really is the tricky one. That's two fighters. What would that look like? Two fighters makes it fifty six. If I take a fighter off of here, though. could risk a fighter from the Berlin attack. And it'll make it, it'll, it'll basically give him a 56 on a 1-2. It's a very calculated attack. He has to do a lot of complex math to figure that out. We've got 18, 19, 20, 21. He's got four transports to bear for a maximum of Or infantry. Actually, the maximum he can well he could bring these guys. Well, one of these guys. So, so well, I could bring them both. So we can bring four infantry total. So four infantry. Yeah, because this guy could come up and grab this artillery, so it could go. Four infantry. So it's probably these four. Four infantry, two tanks, two artillery. And we haven't well, we have we haven't calculated this one, so let's calculate this one. Four infantry, two tanks, two artillery, one fighter, and a cruiser. Against. Thirteen, four, one, and two. Thirteen, four, one, and two. That should be a bloodbath. And an A. That's a bloodbath. He kills four of my infantry. Let's say five. So now we're left with seven. Or eight, sorry, eight. And then the Americans. I'm actually putting you guys through this because I want you to understand how I'm doing the math and how it's calculated if you're new to, if you're new to the game. Um, these guys can come. These guys can come. Oh, boy. He can bring everything to bear. So it's five, six, seven. So it's 14. In, yeah, that's not going to be a work at play at all. So 14 in... It's not even that. It's really uh, three infantry here, four here. That's seven. Eight infantry, two tanks. So that looks like an infantry two tanks. It's three, four, five, six, seven. He's got two 
there. Three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. Nine, ten infantry. Two tanks. Two artillery. Eight infantry, two tanks, two artillery, three fighters. These are in the battleship. One, two, three. Against what I have left over is eight infantry, four tanks, one artillery, two fighters, and an A gun. Well, the A gun will actually be gone. Oh, I do have, I, I can hold on. Eight, four, one, two. Hmm, says I can hold on with what I have there right now. So, the likeliest path for him to retake a victory city is actually Karelia. So. Oh boy, this is risky. I don't want to lose this game because of math and dice. But I've already taken my combat move, so I've, I've committed to it, right? Well, let's commit to it. I think <laughs> this will do it. I hope. All right. Did I do everything right? There are four tanks there. There is. Okay. Artillery seem to hit better when they're paired with paired with infantry. I think that might be better here. Oh man. Oh man. I'm scared. <laughs> I really am. Uh, taking, these, taking these two guys off the board, though, was actually pretty good. Especially only costing me an infantry to do it. That was kind of huge. Otherwise, I don't think I'd be able to do this. Oh, man. I'm going to pause it because... Uh, I want to see. I mean, my. I think my saving grace is that he's a he's not a goal player. Or he might if he's a goal player, he's just barely a goal player. And that's no offense to you, D backer. Um, it's just it seems to me that. Um, well, that just seems to me that's your level of play, and it all really rests on these three infantry hitting. But because they're coming in with the transports, I think they have a tendency to hit better. That's what I'm going to tell myself. Uh. Oh, I wish these guys were in 34. I could love to stick them in Germany. If I could, if I could have put these guys in Germany, that would have, I would have been able to do this easily. Oh, well, not easily, but a little bit less freaked out. But I can't. So my guess is that he might not see it, or he might um, miscalculate which is the stronger option for him to attack, which is clearly Karelia. That is the most vulnerable. All right, well, <laughs> exciting times. Uh, we'll pause it and see if our friend comes online to take his turn. So stay with us. If I hear any clicking whatsoever, I'll come in and I'll, I'll let you guys watch along with me and bite my nails and chew and everything else. So stay with us, folks. 